and it's a great place to develop a spiritual life. I love coming to Nigeria. This is your favorite program on TV. Divine Eat. Atmosphere of Solace. Believe me, today we are going to enjoy ourselves a lot in God's praise. I know it's all about God. So don't worry, we'll be right back. Yes, um, like I said before, my name is Demitopo Francis. People call me Babanshi Buffet, you know. Um, I'm from a family of nine. I'm the sixth born, and my mom is from Ogun State, Abeokuta, precisely. Where my dad is from Delta State, so I claim Delta. I'm from Delta State, you know. Born and brought up in Lagos. I attended Asunashi Boys High School, and it's Rekate Primary, it's Rekate Primary School. Then way back in Suleri, and I still attend Portal Zerite Music School. You know, that's where I learn how to sing, dance and act because music basically is, is all about acting. It's, it's, it's fulfillment, it's, it's, it's a calling, it's what God has called me to do, you know. I played circular for, for several years, and, but I don't, I, I'm not always happy doing it. What I mean I play circular, I used to play in club before, play the normal, normal club song, you know, score them and play them, but I don't have I don't have this piece of mind. Something keeps telling me that this is not where you belong. This is not your place, you know. And I know where I'm supposed to be is 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 is, is gospel. So it, it's a calling. It, it's not what I choose, you know. It's God that chose me to do it. It's a calling. Gospel music, I I is is been long. It's been long. Let's say precisely maybe ten years, because I. When I left the circular, when I left the club, decided to do gospel, gospel music. I work with um, the big boss in the industry, in gospel industry called Sami Oposu. We all know, we all know him. I worked for him, with him for some years then, like three or two years before I, I, I formed my own crew. I started working with him as a dancer. You know, later I discover I can, I can sing then. I, I, I worked with him for like three years before I started doing my own my own crew before I said okay I can do my own things you know let's say 10 years plus now challenges I I I I I don't like calling it challenges I call it road like desert road to your promised land <clears throat> you understand why I said that is because you can't just go to the promised land without going through desert and in the desert you don't find water you don't find food is it time that time is is it, people call it challenge but i feel that time is when god is trying to cook you up god is trying to make you set for the fame god is trying to arrange you for where you are going to because if you are not well arranged you might fall at the roadside when you get there or you may get there and come down or you might not even get there or you might do for shortcuts you know so challenges is a normal road to the promised land. So normal, 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 normal thing that other artists call challenges. Maybe when you, you go to ministration and church not pay you, they give you God bless you. You know, maybe you 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 you, you, you transport yourself there. So how are you going to get back home and all that? So people see that as challenges, but me I see it like road to success. <laughs> My first role model is King David. You know, I study about him a lot. I watch movies about him. 
you know i learned a lot of, um, from him you know king david then apart from king david samuel samuel Kusu is one person I, I i really appreciated he has impacted a lot in me you know the midnight crew midnight crew for their support and their understanding the spiritual aspects top alabi those are three or four people I can say, I can call, you know, as a role model. In my album I'm holding in my hands, you, I, I, you can see, I have different style of music there. I have High Life in this album, I have Fuji in this album, you know, Tsumba, you know. I I am not this kind of place that you can say, okay, this is my style of music. Like the Babanshi Buffet is like Fuji mixed with hip-hop. So music is... I don't have a I don't have a style of music. I do good music. I derive my inspiration from message, listening to pastors. You know, listening to pastors' message. That is why anywhere you find me, listening to pastors' message, I listen carefully. I jot down because it's like the word of God. We just have to add, add melody into it. That will make it music. So. My inspiration is from listening to pastor's message, studying the scripture. You know, that's how I get my inspiration from. Well, we like the first person I, 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 I used to get inspiration from anytime I, I listen to his message. I get inspiration of humility from his message. And that is Prophet Peter Adebisi Abiola. You know, then Daddy E. E. You know, Kadija Adeboy. Then Pastor Emmanuel OEM, you know, those are the men of God. I, I, they are much, but just to mention few. I mean, I'm not an artist, gospel artist. Trust me, I could have been a footballer. You know, I could have been a footballer in the sense that I, I, I play football to some level. You know, but my parents stopped me. I I don't know if I'm permit I'm, I'm permit to mention some names of some guys I play with, and they are making waves now in, in Europe, like Yusuf Aila, like um, Yusuf Aila. Um, this guy, oh, um, if I you Daisy, you know, all all those guys in Sule, you know, we are together. But my parents did not allow me. Then in future, I would love. To promote gospel artists in future gospel artists in future and we are taking a step gradually we are we have our record already we have buffet record already you know, then we are working on some artists by those who is going to help us for now before now i used to i used to be i used to um, be i used to shoot the making of movies you know apart from music I was one that shot the making of a movie called Etiqueta by Said Balogun. I work with Said Balogun too, but I stopped. I stopped early this year. So now it's music, 100% gospel music. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
is over with. Just to the highway, as many as you find, or more bring them to the cafe. I don't know where they switch, I should follow up on some. I don't know where they are, 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 I don't know where they are. I cannot easily forget like that. One of the one of those days was last year. I just received a call that I'll be ministering at the Spiritual FM Christmas Praise Jam. You know, for someone like Dan Foster to give you a call, I was like, wow. Ministry alongside with great gospel artists. I was very, very happy. Then the other one was um, a church called me and asked me to how much do you charge? I said, I, I don't charge church. And I was hoping it's all those normal, normal 5K, I just give you 10K after your administration. And for the first time, the church write a check of 250,000. I was like, ah, oh yeah, I'm learning, you know. I can't forget those two days. Okay, the artists I like to work with in the future, you know, in our next album, you know, by God's grace, we'll be working with Dedrick Anderson. You know, we are discussing with him already, so hopefully we'll be working with him in our next album, my God's grace. Hopefully in our next album, there's a track we'll, feature, we'll be featuring Topo Alabi, by God's grace. Um, there's another track we'll be featuring three artists, you know. One is actually a DJ, is a gospel DJ called DJ Gosporella. DJ Gosporella, Topo Alabi and the Chef Crew with Samuel Pusu. We are working on that too in our next album so in future one american artist two nigerian artists in future well what prompts me to music hmm. well i i'm not those kind of artists that i'll tell you they've been singing from the age of eight from the age of whatever, whatever. i've been singing i started singing when i was 16. that's when i started singing so it's it's love for them it's love for entertainment i just like to make people happy you know i like to make people smile you know that's what pumps me into music then later i become a calling you know become a calling that's okay this is what you are called for then we thank god we stood by it we hold on to it and god has been faithful i wrote the song six five years ago you know Babanje Buffet. So, you know, um, in the in that scripture, there is a certain there is a certain king that um, wants to have a get together. Then, you know, in that get together, he organizes a lot of people. You know, and unfortunately, nobody shows up. So he said, okay, now my servant go to the highway, as many as you find, just bring them to this party, just bring them to this buffet. So you know. The servant is there, so I now imagine that as the servants are there, the chefs who are there, because people make those food. 
So that is where the name come out from. The chef, Topalili and the chef crew. That's why you see us, that's where you see us go to minister, we dress like chef. So when we minister to your soul, I'm sure so you don't need to eat. By the time you've danced and you are you are in happy mood and you are you are you are happy, or no need for food, you just go home and sleep. <laughs> So that is the idea of the of the of the costume. Well, uh, people are asking me that ah, there is pot, there is a spoon here, and you know where are the pot and the stove. Right? We went to miss that one um, concert like that. A guy came to me and said, "Guys, the man is very serious. Ah, day here, big fried rice." And the guys were very serious. So at the end of the day, we after after ministering the song, there was like ah. So you guys came to sing, you know. The, the 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 idea is just that as we are singing to the glory of the Lord, as we are packing this, using this spoon to pack some food, you know, it's a spiritual food, you know, because God eats praise. That is His food. So for us to cook that food, we must cook it in a hygienic place. We must look decent, look neat, because you know God is king. Now. So the best, best, the best cookers, those are people that can cook for God. That's why you see all this costume, you know. Chef, ah, my best food. <laughs> my best food, well, all food, all, all, foods, all foods are good, but my best food is all right plantain, boiled all right plantain with vegetable. That's my best food. Well, my uh, advice for the youth is that um, you must discover what you have inside of you because it's there inside of everybody. Because God created everybody to have something inside. So if you discover that thing inside of you and embellish it, you know, it's better than, you know, doing wrong things, you know. Just discover that God gifting talent inside of you. Then.
Chef Clue, what do we go cook today? Oh, we go sing, we go dance, we go rejoice. Well, well, so take this. People no go remember to chop of food. Baba she buffet, buffet. Baba she buffet, Baba she buffet. Baba she bu, Baba she buffet. Baba she bu. Okay, wait him, be buffet. Buffet na salvation, invitation na Jesus. I say ticket na the grace to follow Baba and to do His will. To ba ti lo meta ye o ti do mo Baba ni ye e o ti do mo Baba. Certainly o ti do mo Baba ni ye. Buffet ni ye o jo. Yes, so my people, once again, I'm Demi Tokwe Francis, aka Tokwe Hallelujah Babanshe Buffet. This program, a wonderful program, Divine Eat, Atmosphere of Solace. And this my album is out to Babanshe Buffet, Tokwe Hallelujah and the Chef. We just try and grab a copy, you know. In this album, we have a lot of good songs that will affect your life. And there's a particular track of feature Midnight Crew. You know, and watch out for our next video. I for for long. Coming up very soon. God bless you. Nigeria, and it's a great place to develop a spiritual life. I love coming to Nigeria.